Hello, and welcome to User Experience Design, Understanding User Engagement by Pack Publishing. I'm, with that, I'm your guide, Chris Becker. I have a background in graphic design from Colorado State University and a master's degree from the Art Center College of Design in Pasadena in media design. And I've been freelancing as a senior UX designer, and I reside in Los Angeles, and I've worked in, with many agencies, startups, SaaS companies, and the like. And I've been educating at both UCLA and Art Center and continue to kind of do this. So let's get started. In this course overview, we'll discuss our five basic user experience topics that have to do with user engagement. So if we look at this kind of breakdown in the first topic of discovery and human-centered observations, we're really going to start with understanding humans first. We'll explore some observation methods, understand how quantitative and qualitative data is used in user experience, We'll explore ways and methods at which to track your user's experience. We're going to review and understand how conversations and interviews are important to understanding what your users do and how emotions and feedback become part of how we engage and understand what problems to solve. In the second talk, we'll really dive deep into human-centered design. Humans are real people and how we get to know them. We'll explore building on our empathy. We'll make proto-personas as, as an exercise. And then we'll define our users in more discrete terms and what is necessary to build a proto persona. In our third topic, we'll kind of build on that empathy and we'll share what we know. We'll create a broader spectrum understanding of what is known as a persona. We'll design one using standard Illustrator and some other software. And then we'll find good images for making that person feel real. We'll explore some data. We'll build on what is a typical day in the tracking, and then we'll test to see if our persona holds true. In the fourth topic, we'll really start digging into what makes a habit for users, how we establish them, how we observe them. We'll understand what we want to observe from a user experience habit. We'll talk about good habits versus bad habits. We'll explore why we create habit cycles, and then we'll try and develop a new habit set up something that will be part of creating what could be a new feature or an output, and we'll design that as we move forward. In our fifth topic is really about taking all of this collection and boiling it into user insights. We'll write our own insight, we'll create a really clear point of view, we'll craft that point of view to then iterate and test, and then we'll review the course as a whole. So throughout the process of this course, you'll really start to engage in the process of learning, taking some new knowledge, applying those UX principles in a certain way and then testing them for the outcomes at which we're engaging in, especially when it's related to how user experiences understands engaging with users. So let's get excited about learning about the human side of UX because human experience and user experience is designed for creating for humans and that becomes the best part. If you haven't watched or if you're new to user experience and you haven't engaged in the fundamentals of user experience on pack publishing, it would be helpful to, before to get a ground base. So go watch that video, those set of videos, and then come back and start this.